At this time there was a wise man called Jesus, and his conduct was good, and he was known to be virtuous. Many people among the Jews and the other nations became his disciples. Pilate condemned him to be crucified and to die. But those who had become his disciples did not abandon his discipleship. They reported that he had appeared to them three days after his crucifixion and that he was alive. Now, that is a reading from one of the writings of Josephus. It is one I recommend by Paul L. Mayer. I have this copy. And it talks about, amongst many other things, Jesus. Now, Josephus was a Jewish historian during the first century, and he lived in Rome. Now, he was writing to a Roman audience, but what he still wrote concerning Jesus is still factual. So the idea that Jesus did not exist, and that he was a figment of the imagination or a Jewish myth, is not only unhistorical, it's also something that makes no sense. Why would the Jews make up a messiah that only got them more persecuted and killed more often and gained absolutely nothing for them in the end. The Jews already had enough going against them. Why would they make up something that made their lives even worse? Again, on top of all of that, we have historians that did not believe in him, did not like him, did not like Christianity, and they still wrote about him. Another historian is Tacitus. He was a Roman historian who absolutely hated the Jews and the Christians. And he made fun of the Christians. So why would we make that up? They gained them nothing. In the end, it actually killed more of them.